Seth, absolute pleasure to see you back at Pride Park Stadium. I know it's not the first time that you've been back, but is it special every time you come back here? Yeah, it, it definitely is. You know, just driving in today, you know, just brings back memories of obviously the time I was here, the, well, the two times I was here. Um, yeah, it just makes you, you know, miss. These are the days that it was all about, you know, the match day was the, the big thing for me when I was playing more. You know, a lot of the players used to love the training and the, you know, the camaraderie and all, but match day was the one where it's really, you know, it's really what it was all about for me. Are there particular memories? Are there things that stand out when you maybe drive into the car park? Yeah, just obviously the the fans, you know, the, especially the first time I was here in the Premier League, you know, it was a full house every week. Um, and you think about the lads you used to play with and, you know, some of the games that, you know, they've been involved in and things like that. So, yeah, it was always brings back fond memories and stuff. And I know you, you're back from, from time to time. You must be really pleased to, to see the progress that Derby are making at the moment, given where we were only sort of six, eight months ago. Yeah, definitely. You know, the, the, the club was in a, a real mess, wasn't it, for a year or two. And, you know, the, the new you know, the new owners have come in and, they've, you know, they've got a new manager in who's done a great job and the, the team are really flying at the moment. So it's, yeah, it's fantastic for the, for the whole area, really, for the supporters, everyone, you know, they, they're still following the numbers and, you know, it's, it's a huge club and, you know, it's a club that's on the up. So hopefully that continues. How did it feel for, for former players and for someone like you who gave, you know, absolutely everything for the club to see what was happening? How, how did that affect you? It was just, it was just a strange one, you know. Just looking, looking on from afar, but it was just, it was just, you know, how do you get to, to this stage? You know, how does it get into such a mess? But it was, yeah, it was obviously upsetting and frustrating, really. You know, with the, all the transfer embargo stuff and not being able to bring the players and that the manager wanted at the time, it was just, yeah, it was a real shame. And but you know, just looking forward, it looks like it's on the up, and hopefully, you know, get promoted this season and you know, move on from there. You were saying special day today because your dad's here and he's not been to the game for a while. No, he hasn't. Yeah, so he lives in Spain now. He's uh, his last game was the playoff final for West Brom in 2007. Was it? Is that, is that the final? Yeah. So yeah, so he's uh, he's looking forward to it. So yeah, it'd be nice for him. How do you remember that day? All these years on. Yeah, with fond memories. You know, it was a bit of a mixed bag. I've said many a time I, I got injured tw right towards the end and never played again. But, you know, the actual day and the build-up to it and obviously winning the game and obviously the, the feeling of promotion was unbelievable. You know, one I'll, I'll always remember and cherish. It was a special day for, for everyone. And we were saying as well, you're, you're a local lad these days. We won't say where exactly you live, but, but you're not far from, from Derby. And, and a lot of players seem to settle around here after they, they finish. Well, why do you think that is? I don't know. I think it's just a, a nice part of the world to live um, you know a few well I've still got a few old mates who live quite close so um, and my kids go to the to the games and stuff so it's, yes it's a nice nice place to be. Do the kids enjoy hearing stories about dad the, the derby hero? No not really I don't think so I think, they, I think they get bored by stuff like that so trying to stick the old uh, VC, VHS on every now and again from but no they're not interested. Well you're a hero to, to thousands it's great to see you as always. Thank you very much cheers.